High roller, sweet. Casino floor. Things are getting stranger every day. Welcome back. Very good. On occasion, it's proven to be more profitable in the long run to simply buy out the competition. And this is one of those occasions. Most merchant companies, successful merchant companies rather, have them. It can be inconvenient to replace employees on short notice. The contracts keep employees around for a specific duration of time after which they get paid. After their upkeep and expenses are deducted, of course. Food, water, living quarters, medicine and clothes, just the basic stuff. It all comes out of the company's coffers. Yes, and they have been for decades now. The hired hands know what they're signing up for. We don't hide anything with fancy talk. That's because we are. We always pay up when the contract ends, though. Won't stay in business long if you've got a reputation as a cheat. All right. Is there any... It's been a pleasure. Well, now that I'm free of the outpost, I was wondering if you'd mind making a detour. I'd like to pay my respects to the end of Cassidy Caravans. Check out the site where they died. <sighs> Upside of Vegas, here, Tal. Trapped at the Mojave outpost, so I wasn't able to run there when I heard. Been weeks since it was hit. So the site's probably a Cazador nest by now. Got word back on what happened from Rangers. Guess they found enough in the wreckage to identify it. <sighs> Only wishful thinking on my part, most likely. At the least, I'd like to pay my respects. I got them into this mess. I owe them that much. Well, you have to know what to look for. Some of the caravan might be ash, but we were expecting raiders and over-inquisitive NCR border guards. There might be something left. If I'm there with you, shouldn't be hard to spot. And I'd prefer to see the bodies with my own eyes. Ask him. Gift for my dad, along with my name. Rose of Sharon Cassidy. Mom said he got the name out of some old world book about dirt pilgrims. Name sure sounds sweet, though. Anyway, Pendant's a little rose. Originally thought it was one of Mom's tribal necklaces, but no. Came from Dad. You know, like one of the tribes from the East? We got him out West, too. NCR's herding them up, though, domesticating them. Mom was from east of the Colorado, though. 
not sure what tribe. It was before the time Caesar rounded them up, made them legion. She walked a hell of a way until she crossed paths with my dad, and he convinced her to stop walking. And lucky for me, he was a horny old bastard. Didn't ask mom to elaborate. Never heard her complain about his bedroom behavior. Only complain he wasn't around to do it no more. Not much to tell. He ended up walking east one day when I was young and never came back. Not a family deserter like some, though. Mom died waiting for him, and she had me to raise. She was sick, but she held off dying until I was old enough to be getting into trouble with the boys. As for Dad, I figure he just got himself lost or dead. Happens. And I'm not all boo-hoo about it, so save your glass for someone who's crying. Not a clue. When he left, I was too in my crib to understand why, and around the time Mom passed, I was too into my teens to listen. Got his name, got this pendant, and that's about it. Short of caps is what taught me, mostly. Ammo's expensive, so I learned to make every shot count. And here tell my dad was a crack shot, so I don't want to dirty the family name. Not out of pride. Respect. Dynamite's for when you don't have enough bullets, want to clear a pass or scare off geckos from a caravan. Some of Twisters out of the Divide can block off a pass in no time, so you learn how to handle powder so you don't get trapped somewhere. Any event, I prefer shooting if it comes down to an argument. Don't worry, I'll carry my weight if a disagreement arises. What, you mean like spears? No, none of that. Mom was a tribal, but she didn't teach me anything like that. All right, then. Did you know the strips all stir- Inside the lucky 38? Oh, not sure whether that's a blessing. At? Not sure if I chose it or it chose me. Dad ran a bar a long time ago and it was a labor of love, Mom said. Didn't sound like it made her happy. Still, I'm guessing I got some of Dad's love of whiskey in me because the burn suits me fine. He used to call me Whiskey Rose back west, before I punched enough people, so now they say it. But quiet, and when I'm not around. Yeah, on account of my name. And the blossoms on my cheeks when I drink too much. Won most of those fights, too. Can take a hell of a punch and give it right back when I've got a bottle in me. It's all in how you drink it, though. There's a trick to it. When we pass the bottle, I'll show you how it's done. There's usually a bar in every stop along the road. Helps me sleep. Well, not really, but I tell myself that. Sometimes I have to brew it myself if I'm too far from a bar. Not quality, but I'm for anything that takes the edge off the day. Yeah, what else are you gonna do with an empty bottle? Wait for it to refill itself? Get me some ingredients out of the Mojave, an empty bottle, a little time, and I'll keep us stocked. Ask him then. I'm fair with chucking dynamite, not bad with a pistol, if I do say so myself. Carry a knife too, but that's more for practical reasons. Prefer settling things with my fists though. Made more friends than corpses in bar fights. Plan on keeping it that way. Don't think I'm some kind of vault city pacifist, though. If things get heated, I'll start shooting. Trust me. Ask him, then. Started? Took to it like a fish to water. Well, if you know what a fish is. Well, of course I do. It's this slimy, scaled thing. Like a lake lurk, except no legs. Well, most times. They're like birds, except they stay underwater. Anyway, I've seen pictures. One guy even had one above his bar in Reading, except it was made of pre-war plastic. He used to say it could sing, but I figured he was on a jet rush. Actually, it 
sort of fell on me. My feet get antsy if I stay in one place, like the Mojave outpost. It was driving me crazy, that feeling of being trapped there. So thanks for that. Yeah, west, east, and pass through places enough times people would sometimes pay me some caps to take something to the next town. Well, not as glamorous, I guess. Roads back west were safer in most places. Most. Anyway, occurred to me I could scratch the traveling itch and get paid for it. Cassidy caravans formed around me. Rest is history. Ask him then. Not much, and I haven't had occasion to look for anything more than that. I've heard what most people know. He's said to run New Vegas. He runs the robots, but, well, no one's really seen him. Well, except you, that is. Ask Sounds good to me. Heard up lately? God, there's almost nothing left. Looks like whoever it was, was just in the mood for killing. Most of the cargo's ash, too. Not burn, looks like disintegrated. When I heard the reports, I assumed ash meant burned. So close to the Vegas wall, too. Don't that beat all. Must have happened during the day, though. They hadn't made a camp. No idea. Maybe catch the sun in their eyes? Maybe they wanted the caravan to come to them, walk into an ambush. We should check the wagon. They may not have got everything. Whatever we find, it's yours. Least I can do for hoofing it all this way with me. Steve, all this traveling is making me You know what? What happened in my caravan? Not the first time I've heard about an attack like that. One of our caravans got hit a few months back, and the caravan been burned too, along with the cargo. I wonder if he made the same mistake, and that other caravan got hit with energy weapons too. Yeah, it's a ways though. Hell of a detour. You sure? All right, then. All right, let's roll out, then. Sure hope you know what you're doing. I think we should explore the next one, see what's up. Got my curiosity riled. Ask him, then. More energy weapons hit this caravan. Place has been picked clean. This is Brotherhood level murder here. But they don't do things like that. This was done with a purpose. Let's poke around a bit, see what we can find. Might be something in the wreckage.
What's that? Looks like a map. Got the route along the west of Vegas, and they've marked another spot. Over here along this stretch. That's fucked up. Middle of nowhere. Yeah. Something's wrong. I can feel it. It's not any closer than the first. So if you'd rather let be, let me know. All right, then. Let's move out. Holding my breath. Sure could use a drink. Shh. We're hunted. Shitheads. Hey there, need anything? Hey there, need anything? Sure.
good not to have to drag a Brahmin train across the Mojave. Staying low. Another caravan burned. Except someone made camp here. And I never heard about this attack. Let's look around. Something stinks. That does it. That's all I need to know. Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs. They were behind burning these caravans, and they've got to answer for them. I'm gonna get some extra ammo, a few bottles of whiskey, and then show them how Cassidy's settle accounts. NCR? Are you out of your fucking mind? That'd take years. And with the war with the Legion, no way they're going to waste time running up the Crimson Caravan or the Van Graffs. All right. If you poke around the Van Graffs and Alice, fine. But if I see either one go into their camp, I'm going to start shooting, no matter what you find. All right, then.
I've heard... Staying low. Do you find any evidence yet? I'm not gonna wait forever. So there's just one more safe to crack? Hope you can get to it. Say what you will about the two leading ladies. They watch their lockers like crows. Still, you got one, so the other might not be impossible. If you get both, then let's talk. And I appreciate you putting yourself at risk like this. Thanks. All right, then. Staying low. Things are getting so... Glad I left the outpost behind. Your safety guarantee. Reset. Your safety guarantee. T. stuff we're not even allowed to sell Stop by the hungry we'll thirsty you the meat. horny the atomic wrangler has you covered Evening. Welcome to the Silver Rush, New Vegas' best source of laser... ...and plasma. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to search you before letting you in. The only weapons allowed on the premises are the ones we're selling. It should only take a moment. There. I've stored all of your weapons. You're clear to enter. When you leave, I'll hand them all back to you. The bosses are having a meeting. You'll have to wait until it's over. Mr. Soren, please get to the point. like that? Mr. Soren, please get to the point. You. The second Close. half of your payment is late, and I want to know why. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality of the weapons is below expectation, and hope to adjust the price accordingly. Ah. I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. Okay, everyone. Show's over. Back to work.
evening. Holding my breath. Holding my breath. You find any evidence yet? No shit. There it is. The blood, the motive, as clear as day. 
They must have penned these with snake venom. But we got it. Now what? Sure, this damns them, but only if someone listens. Well, Jackson and the Mojave Outpost could get it to the folks in the West. I wouldn't trust anyone closer to the Colorado. And the Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs have their heart back west. Not sure it'll do any good, though. All right, let's do it. Listen to what he has to say. Keeping quiet. Evening. Welcome to the Silver Rush, New Vegas' best source of... ...laser and plasma weapons. Staying low. Kings are led by the king. Has some kind of robot dog. Guess it hunts a robot rat. Glad I left the outpost behind. The Ranger vets are on their way from Baja. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you, but nothing else on the radar at the moment. What is it? Let me see. All right, this is... This explains a lot of the lost caravans. I thought it was Legion work, but... I can, if you make me a promise. I need you to swear you won't take revenge on Gloria or Alice. If you do, then your case is over, and we can't see that justice is done. I know some things are hard to let go, but you and Miss Cassidy need to understand that. Hear me? I can promise that. What happens after? Ugh. Not even God himself could move the Congress in or out of session. And this... this is a tricky matter. God, what a mess. People turning against each other when the Mojave's at risk of falling? If the Republic's sinkhole progress doesn't kill us, greed will. Thanks for bringing me this. I know revenge must have been tempting. For what it's worth, I appreciate you didn't shed any more blood. We need to save our strength for the Legion. I'll do what I can, and those folks that got killed need to be answered for. Well, that's settled, I suppose. Feels... I don't know. I guess I feel relieved. I don't know what I feel. Wait, that's not true. I think the NCR back west, when riled, is gonna be the worst enemy the Van Graffs and the Crimson Caravan ever had. They're all so mired in procedure and paper out there. 
The kind of evidence we gave is going to be worse than shooting them. I think that settles accounts with me and my men. That was some tricky political maneuvering, but worth it, even if it takes a few years. All right, then. Hello. Boomers are a mite twitchy.
An assault on this place would be suicide. I'm amazed. Isn't that bomber a beauty? An impressive piece of work. I'll keep that in mind if jobs come up in the future. Nope. And it... Sure could use a drink. So the NCR makes peace with the kings now? Where was that mercy? Huh? I haven't seen you before. What brings... That's a complicated question. They've done horrible things to our people to be sure, and I've gladly killed many of their soldiers in battle. But I can't bring myself to hate them the way Papa does. Things would damn sure be better for us if they were in charge than Caesar. I suppose if asked, I would. But that's a moot point, because Papa's in charge now, and he's not going anywhere. 
Papa is one of the best leaders the Khans have ever had. He's kept us together through all of our hardships, ever since we left California. Bitter Springs changed him, though. He started to really hate the NCR after the massacre. And sometimes, I worry that's poisoned his mind. Nothing. Forget about it. I shouldn't be talking about this with an outsider. Until next time. Shh. We're hunting shitheads. Soon Caesar will send in his best troops from the Arizona campaign. The NCR won't know what hit him. Glad I left the outpost behind. Soon Caesar will send in his best troops from the Arizona campaign. The NCR. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear weapon. Yes. Did you have an update on the cons? An alliance? That's an interesting proposition. Any plan where I can throw packs of raiders at the enemy instead of my own soldiers is a good one. We don't have time for diplomacy. This battle is coming any time now. If the leader won't be budged, he'll have to be replaced. I want you to go back to Red Rock Canyon and assassinate this Papa Khan. You'll have to be stealthy. If they see you do it, they'll kill you. Here, take this lockpicking gear. Your best bet is to wait until late at night, find a back door, or catch him by surprise when he's alone. Good luck, soldier. Dismissed. Did you know the strip's all stirred up lately? Whiskey and liquor don't last long around here, by the sight of it. So the cub enters the wolf's den.
You should have been with us in our glory days. You'd have loved it. It's always a pleasure to see you around the camp. Have you now? Hmm, well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Don't you dare mention the NCR under this roof. I won't hear any more talk against you. hit. You see a scorpion? That doesn't belong to you. Shit. It's always a pleasure to see you around the camp. You want to hear the story of the Great Khans? It's a long one, full of honor, glory, and betrayal. We have suffered, but we will regain our glory. In a hurry, are you? Very well, then. The Great Khans came east, out of the NCR 14 years ago. We ruled the wastes then, and called no man master. But we underestimated the families of the Strip, and they drove us back to Bitter Springs, where we remained until the NCR arrived and drove us here. They allied with Mr. House, the self-proclaimed master of New Vegas. He supported them with the resources of New Vegas. Weapons, technology, caps. They were better equipped, and we could not stand against them. When the NCR came to the Mojave, we thought they would be easy pickings. We raided their caravans, their towns, their camps. They couldn't stop us. At least that's what we thought. They tracked us to Bitter Springs and surrounded us. When our children, our sick and old, fled through a nearby pass, the NCR gunned them down. Oh, they claimed it was a miscommunication, but tell that to those who saw our families butchered. Tell it to the survivors who were banished here. Typical. 
No reference for... You march all the way out to Red Rock Canyon, enter my home as bold as you please, and you have no idea who I am? You've got guts, I'll give you that. Well then, let me educate you. I am the chief of the great Khans. The Khan of Khans, if you like. This is my tribe, and these are my people. Have you now? Hmm, well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Doesn't he? Caesar's representative tells a different tale. The glory of the great Khans will be restored, and once the NCR is pushed back to California, all the land from here to the Colorado will be ours. I won't hear any more. tell you they're a bunch of big dumb jerks with no appreciation for art. I mean, can you believe their initiation? Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I can find my true calling, someplace they'll appreciate my poetry. Someplace like the old Mormon fort, maybe. Do you think the followers of the Apocalypse would take me? I remember all those books they brought us when they visited our tribe. You'd do that? Thanks! I mean, I'd go myself, but what if they said no? The cons wouldn't take me back, and then I'd have nobody. Ah, uh, nothing really. Just trying to psych myself up to try my initiation. Again. Oh, you heard that, huh? Okay, so, yeah, I was writing poetry. I know, I know, it's not a very great con-like thing to do. The followers of the Apocalypse came to our camp when I was a kid, and they brought a bunch of old books. I used to read pre-war poetry for hours. Have you seen this tribe? If it's not an epic, drunken ballad of cracking skulls and hearing lamentations, they think it's a waste of time. Everybody has to do it. Well, everybody wants to be a con anyways. They toss you into the ring there and beat on you for a solid minute. If you survive, you're in. Sure, maybe not if you're some hulking reprobate like Regis or big to the gills like Jack. I've tried five times and still haven't made it. Hmm. Indulgent. What rhymes with indulgent? If fault. No, no, that's terrible. Silver... Silver what? What? You would? Really? Okay, well then, here goes. This one's a haiku. <clears throat> Rad scorpion bites. My foot in the box canyon. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. That's it. What do you think? You liked it? Wow, you're the first one who ever did. Bye. Hmm. Indulgent. What rhymes with indulgent? If all... No, no, that's terrible. How do you spell...
Caesar's veterans will arrive from Arizona soon, and there will be no stopping our victory. They're a tribe of fine warriors with many proud traditions and a glorious history. They will be worthy additions to the Legion. My name is Carl. Glorious Caesar has sent me as an emissary to the Great Khans as a token of our alliance. In exchange for Great Caesar's promise of all the lands west of New Vegas, the Khans have agreed to fight alongside the Legion when the time comes. I am one of the Frumentari. It is my duty to scout the waste in Caesar's name and make contact with any tribes that might serve a useful purpose. You might say I'm somewhere between a scout and an ambassador. I'm assigned here as part of the alliance between the Legion and the Great Khans. Though they have been cruelly oppressed by the NCR, the Khans remain great warriors. The Legion is honored to have such allies in battle. Speak then. Yes, goodbye. I heard you try to convince Papa Khan not to join with Caesar's Legion. I'd like to talk to you about that for a moment. You want to convince Papa not to ally with Caesar, right? Trust me, you'll get nowhere just talking to him about it. He's fixated on restoring the glory of the Great Khans, and he sees Caesar as the path to that restoration. Papa can be a stubborn man, but he's not a tyrant. He listens to his tribe, and to four voices in particular, me, Jack, Diane, and Melissa. If you can convince all of us that allying with Caesar is a bad idea, you might be able to sway him. You'd have to talk to them, but those two have been thick as thieves since they were kids. Convince one, and the other will come around. Ah, Melissa. She's a bit of a dreamer. Last time she was in camp, Carl filled her head with stories of serving the Legion as a speculatore. Personally, I've never seen a woman in Legionnaire's armor, so I have my doubts. I have my doubts about Caesar, yes, but I won't publicly go against Papa Khan based on nothing more than doubts. I've heard rumors that tribes who aligned with Caesar in the past were torn apart and reduced to slaves. Prove it, and I'll back you. Good. Oh, one more thing. Caesar's representative, Carl, has become fast friends with Pava. Carl's the one who has him so fixated on this alliance. You'll probably have an easier time of things if you can find a way to get him out of the picture. Carl talks prettily about the honor and nobility of the Great Khans, but I suspect his actual opinion is less flattering. Maybe you could find something he wrote that expresses that opinion, or trick him into losing his cool in the longhouse right in front of Papa. I would, too, if I were you. The runners are saying that the NCR is sending in their elite shock troop. Greetings in the name of Kaiser. Join? Oh, no, I, I simply couldn't. That is, I'm not worthy of such an honor. Of course I am. That is to say, Caesar has many fine warriors, and I wouldn't wish to compare them to the Great Khan.
Greetings in the name of Kaiser. Enough! How dare you compare Caesar's finest to this tribe of savages? The mightiest great Khan is scarcely a match for a legion recruit. The burned man would leave their mightiest shitting themselves in terror. I would. That is... You motherless bastard. You'll pay for this. Great cons. Drive Caesar. Hey! Ah, you're back. Let's get this in here. Not even slowing it down. You're just in time for your action. Switch to a squirt gun.
train across the Mojave. Let's get this in gear. Time for some get even. Hunting shithead. Don't need this right now.
Lost in gear. Blood. Someone's looking to cash their chips. Keeping quiet.
keeping quiet. Bad guys? Don't see us coming. Let's paint this place red. Serving up some hurt. could use a drink. Staying low. That's close enough. What do you want with the great cards?
Awaiting a delivery, but it's a no-show. I'm guessing that the death claws in the quarry have something to do with that. Is that right? What's your angle? All right, fair enough. You help us out and I'll owe you one. I was expecting a shipment of chemicals. It's usually in a suitcase dropped off in one of the big machines up here. Because of the death claws, I have to assume the suitcase is still in Sloan. Snoop around the place and get it for me. I wouldn't eat or drink them, but no. They won't explode if you drop them or anything. Don't kill anybody if you don't have to. I'm a scout and I like to keep a low profile. Like what? We're an independent group. We take care of our own and don't take crap from anybody. Especially the NCR. Bitter springs happened. Women and children died when the NCR attacked the Great Khans there. And the NCR just pretends it never happened. It wasn't easy. There's a lot of initiation rituals to go through and I've got the scars to prove it. But in the end, I was tough enough to be made a member. Proudest day of my life. Been quiet. Yeah. You need something? I think I know which friend you mean. Even if there weren't death claws in the quarry, there'd still be no delivery. The supplier, a guy in Prim named Tyrone, is a cheating son of a bitch who won't deliver even though he's already been paid in advance. He's always been shady, but this is the first time he's outright screwed me. I'm just a middleman. The Great Khans are a hard group, and some of them are no good. But they're not all the same. I believe in the NCR, but that doesn't make it right for them to roll over anyone who doesn't want any part of them. She's my daughter. Takes a little too much after her mother, rest her soul. But she's happy with the Great Khans, and that's enough for me. Good luck.
Those post office boxes in these old towns too. Hey, hey, what can Tyrone do for you? You're trying to get me busted? Keep your damn voice down. Lieutenant Hayes already has his eye on me. Look, I already told Chomps the NCR is getting suspicious of all these misplaced supplies. Bigger risk means bigger cost. 300 caps bigger. Fine. I'll just eat the cost and do a favor for Chomps. Just this one time only. Nice robot. What do you want now? You actually came through for us. I didn't expect that. Anyway, the Great Khans pay their debts and don't forget their friends. If you ever come out to Red Rock Canyon, I'll put in a good word for you. How's it going? You can ask, but why would I do that? Carl told me all about the life in the Legion. He says I've got all the makings of a speculatory. What? No, he... What do you mean, aren't allowed to serve? 
Why would he lie about that? That lying little weasel. I almost fell for it too. All right, you've got a deal. You can tell Papa I won't support an alliance. Should have heard stories of the cons years ago. They were one tough bunch now. Hello. Hey, what's up? Anders got back a little while before you did. He told me what happened. If that's how the Legion treats my people, I don't want any part of them. Don't worry, Jack and I have talked it over. We'll talk up the idea of breaking the Alliance. Later. You should have been with us in our glory days. You'd have loved it. You should have been with us in our glory days. You'd have loved it. Sure could use a drink. Mr. House isn't a man to be trusted. Watch yourself. You should have been with us in our glory days. You'd have loved it. More of my advisors are starting to talk openly of breaking our alliance. I wonder where that idea is coming from. In a hurry, but typical. Ah, you're soon. Caesar will send in his soon best Caesar will send in Arizona. his best. You honor the great cons. What do you want to know? Suit yourself. Best troops from the Arizona the campaign. NCR won't know what hit them. The NCR won't know what hit them. Ah, you're.
You're becoming quite the political agitator. Sure could use a drink. Nice robot. We're hunting sh shitheads. Lies here, Ken. Being quiet. Holy shit! Keeping quiet. Holding my breath.
We're hunting shitheads. What are you doing here? Without Papa Khan's guidance, I don't know what else to do. All right, you can tell the NCR the Great Khans will fight for them when Caesar attacks. Until next time. Signed a treaty with the Great Khans. Guess you can never have too many low life king beers. Yes. Did you have an update on the Khans? Excellent. You've done very well indeed. These tribals will make useful machete fodder. And if it should turn out we need their land later, well, it's not like we don't have the force to drive them out again. In the meantime, however, I have something else I want you to look into. We've had some disturbing reports recently concerning the Omertas, one of the three families that run the Strip. Our intelligence has discovered that high-ranking members of the Omertas have been having clandestine meetings for the past several months. We haven't been able to determine whom they've been meeting with, but if it's Caesar's men, we'll need to act. I need you to uncover what they're up to and stop it if it threatens the NCR. Any questions? Head to their casino, Gamora, and ask around. If you discover that what they're up to threatens the NCR, stop it. The Omertas themselves likely won't be forthcoming, so you may need to talk to some of their help to pick up a trail. Anything else? Our preliminary research shows that the Omertas used to do some business in Freeside, mostly buying weapons. Any other questions? Liza O'Malley at the Embassy may have some information for you as well. Dismissed.